Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today we are reacting to the Withering Waves Global Launch Trailer. Now this dropped yesterday, but I was extremely stuffy and my throat was just gone. Um, for the life of me, I could barely talk. It was that bad, but I'm feeling better today. So let's get straight into it. I've been hearing very good things about Withering Waves. I didn't get into beta, unfortunately, but let's see how this is gonna look. Cause I'm considering playing this on the channel. Oh. Oh, ho, ho, ho. To begin with, I heard you've lost your memories. If all of these oh. has something to do with your true identity, it looks really good so far, though. Like from what I've seen. Moreover, oh. similar ability with a legendary hero who once absorbed through Nogian. Joy prophesied. Absorbed a what? After all this effort. Do you truly want to throw it all away? Ultimately, I suppose it is up to you oh. to discover the final definitive answer. I'm there seeing a lot of really good potential characters here. Okay, so this is a gameplay. Here you are. Besides, Hello, who are you? I think I might need that one, guys. Oh! Those ultimates look amazing. Is yours to spin. Oh, that looks really, really good, guys. I'm not going to lie. We might end up playing that. Tectone, not now, buddy. Right, okay. So, I want to quickly rewatch that. So, first off, this scene here, this dragon looks amazing. Now, is this a case of Genshin and Honkai Star Rail where we can pick whether we're a female or a male protagonist? Because um, I noticed that there was, like, a character with black hair. I didn't get a very good visual on both of them. But is this, like, one of the female uh, protagonists that we can choose? Let me know for those of you who um, have actually, like, looked into it or played it. Um, I'm guessing the vibe is that, like, losing your memories is definitely a very gotcha thing. Because we've done this, we've seemed to have uh, done the same here. But um, the world here, like, the moving around looks visually stunning like this is a gorgeous look you know like this bit here looks really really cool that's like kind of like a dragon spine area the climbing up looks really good too yeah so that was the other guy i'm i'm getting the sense that they seem to be the male protagonist correct me if i'm wrong and i'm also liking the look of these characters here especially the one in the blue the blue is uh leaning out to me right now um the enemies look amazing. And I'm not gonna lie, the male did look very badass in this bit. Yeah, just like the grin. She looks cute. Some of the, the like, just looking at the gameplay, this is definitely kind of. It looks a little bit like a hardcore Genshin. This character, oh my lord, the the boobs were jing were jiggling. If any of you know me by now, thighs and boobs are my two weaknesses and asses, being my third. So. This character is definitely a smash for me. No, in my luck, she'll be a bloody five-star character, which I'm going to have to either wail for or pull for. But genuinely, this game is looking absolutely amazing. I genuinely would love to play this. Um, I think they said it was an, uh, it was releasing sometime at the end of May. I think they said the 22nd. Is that right? No, I didn't put it in this one. Okay. So... Yeah, would you guys like me to see me play this? Because I am more than happy to re to branch out to other gotcha games because we're going to be doing Honkai Impact 3rd, either April or May time, and this would actually be a really another cool game kind of away from Hoyaverse. So let me know what you guys think because I genuinely would love to try playing this, but I am looking respectfully. Mm -hmm. 